Storm Team 4 now a live look at the highways across southeast Wisconsin. Roads are clear right now, but it could be yep. a slippery morning commute, Brian. Yeah, fast forward about 10 hours uh, from now, and that shot is going to be dramatically different. Uh, right now, winter weather advisory stretching across several states here, all the way back towards Nebraska, South Dakota. That's the tail end of the system, and now the brunt of it's moving through Iowa. And that winter weather advisory now includes a good chunk of southeastern Wisconsin to the southwest of Milwaukee. But everybody is going to see some snow. The chance of precipitation really goes up after six o'clock tomorrow morning. Snow spreads across the area. A guaranteed snow for southeastern Wisconsin. Not a huge snowstorm, but certainly enough that's going to cause some slippery roads. You're going to have to get out there and do some shoveling. It's a live look in West Bend, looking festive at 32 degrees and east wind at five miles per hour. You're going to see we're a few degrees warmer here in Milwaukee at 37 degrees. And it's these mild temperatures that are going to be just above the freezing mark as the snow is falling. That is going to allow for some of the snow to melt. It's going to create that wet, heavy snowfall, but high snowfall rates is still going to allow the accumulation. Let's take a look here across southeastern Wisconsin. You can see some spots well inland below the freezing mark, and that will help out the accumulating snow later on tomorrow morning. So let's go through your weather headlines again. We're looking at a snowy, slushy Friday. And it's going to be that heavy, wet variety of snow. Where is the snow? Well, it's positioned across Iowa. A rain snow mix here. All snow in northern Iowa. All rain across southern Iowa. An area of low pressure that's back towards Omaha, Lincoln, Nebraska is going to track just to the south of us. So let's go through our future forecast. You can see by 6 o'clock, here comes the rain and the snow. Starting off as a mix. But notice the darker blues with this right off the bat. This is going to be a pretty heavy burst of snow during the morning. This is 9 o'clock and you can see snow stretching across most of southeastern Wisconsin, maybe yet to reach locations up towards Sheboygan. Now as we head into the noon hour, still snowing pretty good across southeastern Wisconsin, tapering off to just some light snow in the afternoon, and then by tomorrow evening we should be done. I've adjusted the snow map again a little bit for our 10 o'clock show here and you can see again uh, most of the area is going to be in that two three four inch range but the one to two inch totals will be confined to just a couple miles from the lake shore now our northeastern spots expecting less snow and maybe the highest totals across our southwestern spots over towards jefferson county could see four or five inches of snow a little closer look here you can see as you just get a few miles away from the lake by tosa maybe into that two to four inch range. Your forecast tonight, mostly cloudy chance of rain and snow showers late and then a guaranteed rain and snow tomorrow. One to two inches lakeside, two to four inches inland, a high temperature of 38 degrees. Here's your seven day forecast. Scattered rain and snow showers again on Saturday, but not like what we're going to see tomorrow. Very little or no accumulation expected Saturday. Sunday 41, 43 Monday and rain is likely Tuesday and Wednesday. Here's our weather kid. Hazel, oh, look how cute she is. That is an adorable smile. And Hazel's going to need her gloves, her mittens tomorrow for the snow and the temperature of 35 degrees. We'll be right back.